God bless you. My name is Pastor Jason Ayala with Tent Ministries, and I just want to give you guys an update on the hurricane relief efforts for Fiona. First of all, thank you so much for your contributions. Thank you for helping us alongside to help this make it possible, and we give all the glory and all the honor to God. As you know, Fiona hit Puerto Rico pretty hard in September, and it was a devastation in the island for a lot of folks living there. Thanks to your contributions, we were able to bring over a thousand pounds of resources to the island of Puerto Rico, and we're still continuing efforts to this day. So we just wanna give you guys a brief update and continue to pray for us as we continue the relief efforts for the island of Puerto Rico. In September of 2022, Tent Ministries began collecting relief supplies for Puerto Rico after Hurricane Fiona dumped damaging amounts of water throughout the island. Over 1,000 pounds of supplies were sent over and distributed to communities in need of help. Essentials including pampers and wipes, baby formula, shoes and socks, underwear, adult diapers, backpacks, toiletries, feminine hygiene products, blankets and pillows, and men's, women's, and children's clothing were sent over and distributed in areas most affected and least resourced. The southeast part of the island was hit with heavy rainfall, many areas getting more than 20 inches and some areas receiving over 25 inches. Fiona dumped more than 32 inches on the Ponce region, where the island's second largest city is located. Families in this particular community in Barrio Mameyes suffered material losses and structural damages to their homes as a result of the 2020 earthquakes, and Hurricane Fiona only added to that crisis. Tense Ministries has committed over $11,000 to helping families get back on their feet through your kind and generous donations. Families just like Milagros, a cancer patient. Her mattress was damaged in the hurricane, but since no help was provided, she used her mattress just like this. She would cover it every night with a plastic bag and slept on it with her daughter. Thanks to your help, we were able to purchase a brand new mattress and bed frame for Milagros. Hola, aquí estamos montándole la camita a la nena. Por aquí está mi chica. Saluda. Y nada, quiero agradecer la ayuda que me han dado. Muchas gracias y Dios me los bendiga a todos. Aquí estamos montando la camita. Hola, buenas noches. De parte de Mili Marcusi quiero expresar mi más sincera gracias por haberme enviado la cama y el matrecito para mi hija, de parte de ella también, muchísimas gracias, eh, que Dios me los cuide y me los siga bendiciendo de manera especial para que sigan ayudando a las comunidades que así lo necesiten y que papá Dios le otorgue a, a todo el ministerio y la congregación mucha salud, mucho amor, mucho paz, muchas bendiciones que sus vidas sean prósperas y que sigan teniendo esa relación especial necesaria para con Dios para poder estar viviendo el día a día. Que Dios me lo bendiga, Mili Marcuso y desde Ponce, Puerto Rico. Gracias un millón. Bendiciones. Dios lo bendiga. And to individuals just like Pablo, who had days before Hurricane Fiona hit, just bought groceries when his refrigerator was damaged and lost everything he had. With your help and contributions, we were able to purchase a brand new refrigerator for Pablo. Muy buenas tardes. Saludos, bendiciones. Eh, este mensaje va para el ministerio de allá de Nueva York, este, para el pastor aquí en Puerto Rico y para Ponce TV. Estoy sumamente agradecido por la bendición que ha mandado de la neverita, ya la recibí, ya la tengo en mi casa, ya la estoy utilizando. Gracias a Dios estoy aquí. Gracias por la bendición. 
especialmente a Dios primero y gracias al Ministerio de Nueva York, de parte mía, Pablo, muy agradecido por la bendición. Que Dios los bendiga y Dios los cuide. Gracias que sigan bendiciendo a muchas personas más en sus necesidades. Gracias. And Jennifer, who lost everything in the flood. But thanks to your help, we were able to buy Jennifer a brand new washing machine so that she could once again do laundry for her and her two boys. Muy agradecida con la ayuda que me dieron de la lavadora. Estoy usándola. Muchísimas gracias. And Marie's daughter's room flooded and as a result she lost her bed. She was sleeping with her younger brother until recently. And Sylvia also lost everything in the flooding. In their household, they have three adults and one small child. Sulma's house is still damaged, but she is currently living in one of the rooms that are the least damaged. In Lil Nahir's house, her and her daughters cleaned their mattresses as best as they could, but they began to smell like mold and humidity. Thanks to your help, we were able to buy beds and bed frames for Marie, Sylvia, Sulma, Lil Nahir, and more families just like them in and around the affected area in Ponce. But our work is far from over. We still want to reach communities like Barrio Aguilita and Barrio Plena in Juana Diaz, where the Inaban River overflowed, flooding a large number of residences in both communities and washing away at least three houses. And Barrio Playa and Barrio Faro in Guayanilla, which was the epicenter of the earthquakes in 2020, which caused the community to sink eight inches below sea level. Hurricane Fiona brought a huge storm surge, and the Guayanilla River overflowed and flooded both communities. Many families have still yet to receive help, but you can join Tent Ministries and follow our progress as we continue to bring relief to the people of Puerto Rico. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube at TentNYC, and make a contribution towards our relief efforts at give.tentnyc.org. Every penny of donations that you give towards Hurricane Fiona goes straight to helping families affected by the hurricane get back on their feet. Thank you and God bless your giving.